what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Boy, I tell you, the more I learn about this case, the angrier I become. It's now being reported that the neighborhood of Satilla Shores, located in Brunswick, Georgia, where Ahmaud Arbery was murdered, has a Facebook page. It's a group page where they discuss all types of interesting topics. One that stands out is the topic of murdering the wrong black person who they catch in their neighborhood. Family, it was planned. They planned to kill this man all along. It could have been any black person. At their discretion, they decided who was the right person or who was the wrong black person to be in the neighborhood. So that means that depending on how they felt, it could have been anybody. This is why you have to take these monsters, these animals off the streets. They're unfit to live among the civilized. They decided that they were going to kill any black person that they caught in the neighborhood that they deemed to be the wrong black person. The neighbors shared this discussion. They shared memes that was disparaging of blacks. This guy, Travis McMichael, his schoolmates, the people that grew up with him in his neighborhood, they said that this guy was a known racist. They said he had strong racist views. I don't know how you can have a weak racist view, but they said this guy really, really reveled in his racism. And when they found out that he was accused of killing Ahmaud Arbery, none of them was shocked. In fact, one was quoted as saying, I thought it would have happened sooner. Let's go back to the neighborhood. When I first heard about this, I said that Travis McMichael and his stanky daddy, Gregory, was living in a neighborhood where racism was not only accepted, it was encouraged. See, these type of dudes, they don't go anywhere where they don't feel really comfortable. They have to be comfortable. That means that they have to be around people who share their views. All of those fools that was in that Facebook group knew exactly what was coming down the pipeline. They knew it. And they did nothing. They had an obligation to go to the police and speak on it. But they didn't. Now that I think about the police in Glenn County, ah. Don't know how much help that would have been. But anyway, they had an obligation. They all sat back and they watched it happen. They all should be booked for murder. Conspiracy to commit murder. All of them are culpable. Every single one of them. They got a whole Facebook group. Were they just sitting around, just talking about it, bringing harm to black folks, sharing memes, laughing, kicking it? Every single one of them. Now keep in mind, family, 
The guy who owned the house that was under construction, this guy said that he watched the tape of Ahmaud Arbery. He wasn't concerned about him looking around the place. He said nothing was stolen. He did nothing wrong. There was absolutely no reason for them to kill this guy. They hunted him and they killed him like a deer. They just gunned the dude down just because they felt like it. They got to go. The kids too. No more talk. What the ladies talking about?